Hello Pisces and welcome to your reading for today. This is going to be a general energy reading for you and we're going to see what's important for you to know at this time. What's the message for you from spirit? Ooh, we got ten of cups and the tower. Okay, we'll keep that in mind. Um, now remember this can be past, present, or future. Okay, you're going to know where this resonates in your story. Now let's see Pisces, Holy Angels, and the Divine Spirit. What is important for Pisces to know? What's the message for Pisces today? What's going on with Pisces? What does Pisces need to know? What's going on here today? Let's see. We got the chariot at the bottom of the deck. <clears throat> Death. Okay, so I don't know. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. Or you could be dealing with a Cancer. We got heavy on the water signs today, okay? Or something could just be completely over. Something is ending here. Now we have the five of swords in reverse, which means that somebody has to put their weapons down, okay? Um, somebody might be feeling defeated, okay? Somebody may be defeated in a, some sort of a way. Moving on to calmer waters, or someone is leaving something behind. Maybe you're leaving something behind now. You get to leave, you get to move on to more peaceful waters, more calm waters. Maybe you just don't even feel like engaging with a fight, okay? You don't feel like fighting. You're moving on to more practical things. It's almost making me feel like um, something's not even worth your energy. Something's not even worth the fight. It's like you don't even want to engage in some sort of like a five of swords like this manipulative mind game kind of a thing. Like it's, it's really giving me, I'm too, I've got, I've got other priorities besides the mind games. Like I'm not playing the mind games. I've got other things to take care of, okay? Putting an end to this mind game thing. Like I have, yeah, even with the four swords under the chariot, it's like you're in this peaceful energy, okay? Your, um, your thoughts are very collected. Like you literally skipped over, you're skipping over the five, right? You're like, nah, I don't feel like dealing with the mind games. I'm going straight from the five, uh, the four to the six. Like I'm going to stay in this peaceful, healed, calm, centered energy. I'm not dealing with the mind games. I'm going straight to calmer waters, okay? How interesting is that? It's like you have better things to deal with, okay? You have bigger goals in your life than dealing with some sort of a... It's almost like that, that energy of like somebody wants to start a fight or somebody wants to like confront you on something, okay? Like they might come to you and, and try to start some sort of an argument with you is almost what I'm getting. And you just, your energy is kind of just like, okay. Like it doesn't even get to you. You don't even take it personally. Like whatever this person is doing, it doesn't even hit you. You just immediately put it down and go, okay. Well, I'm going back to my peace now, okay? You just, you just kind of like, Graze directly over something here. Hmm. Let's see, why is death here for Pisces? Two of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles, and the Two of Cups. Okay, so this could have something to do with a relationship. A relationship maybe that you have to someone. The King of Pentacles, maybe this is someone that you're dealing with, okay? Two of Pentacles. Huh. I don't know if you were weighing something back and forth in your mind. Hmm. Well, I'll just see what this is. What's the five of swords reverse? The three of swords, yeah. King of Wands. So 
So now we have a King of Wands here, okay? So we have a King of Pentacles, King of Wands. I don't know if this is the same person or these are two different people. The Three of Swords, but it, this is the this is the the hurt. This is the heartbreak. This is the hurt. This is what you you grazed right over, right? It's like you didn't let something get to you. You didn't take something personally. Is what I almost feel. Ace of Coins has something to do with um, some sort of an offer or something to do with a gift or a money gift or a money investment. Ten of Pentacles in reverse. Hmm. We're going to have to figure this one out a little bit. What's the Six of Swords? The Eight of Wands. The Page of Swords. I do feel like it's an argument. Like this has something to do with communication. Like it could have something to do with a with a with a conversation that was had. And somebody is just like, I don't feel like dealing with this. I don't know. Yeah, six of swords. I don't feel like dealing with this. Six of swords is coming out on top of the six of swords. Like there is some sort of a conversation that was had here. It could have been somebody that came towards you and wanted to start an argument with you, or they wanted to start some sort of like the Eight of Wands, it could even be like somebody came at you, like you just sat down and they're like, hey, I gotta talk to you right now. And you're like, blah, 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 in your face. <laughs> and you're like, oh my God, I do not have time for this right now. I cannot, I don't wanna deal with this right now, okay? That's kind of what I'm getting, you know? <laughs> like with death here and the Two of Cups, like this could even be something. <laughs> oh, sorry. It's almost giving me even like maybe an ultimatum, okay? Like something about an ultimatum maybe. What's the Knight of Pentacles? Like, oh, fine, okay. You want to go that way? Okay, it's like... Hmm. The Ace of Cups. Four of Pentacles in reverse. Two of Wands in reverse. Someone here is not willing to play some sort of game. Like Four of Pentacles reverse is like when somebody tries to give you that ultimatum and then you're just like, eh, whatever. You just let it go. Two of Wands reverse, you're like, I'm not going that path. I don't really feel like making that choice. I don't feel like doing that. I just, hmm. Let's see what this is. Tell me more about death, please. What exactly is over here? The Queen of Pentacles. Something is over with a Queen of Pentacles. Four of Cups. Someone here feels like they're missing an opportunity, okay? What is death? Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. This could be a married couple. Courtship. Okay, well, so it might be a relationship. It might have something to do with a relationship here. Queen of Pentacles, King of Pentacles. This could be a married couple. Doesn't have to be though. There's two, definitely, it's definitely a relationship. So this has something to do with a relationship being over maybe. Okay. Why is the four cups here? A child. Someone is feeling rejected over a child or someone feels like they're missing an opportunity with a child or because of a child girl with the snake empath and narcissist paradigm being charmed or used so this could really be like i don't know who, i don't know what this is okay i feel like you in the collective you're gonna or you pisces whoever this reading is for is gonna know it feels kind of like Someone here wanted to make someone some kind of like an ultimatum or put like pressure on someone. Like have someone in some sort of a, like two minds, like I don't know what to do, okay? Could have something to do with a relationship. Like with child coming out, I don't know if someone's trying to use children as like some sort of like a leverage, okay? Or in some sort of a manipulative like... um ultimatum situation like well if you don't do what i say then you're not gonna see your kids like something like that because i don't know why four of cups would be here with child if it's not like 
somebody feeling dissatisfied about something. What's this two of pentacles? A mask. Someone is not showing their true feelings. Hiding, personifying, pretending something here. Or someone is wearing a mask. Someone is hiding something. Somebody is pretending to be someone that they're not. Somebody could be two-faced. Two of pentacles. This could be someone with two faces. They have two sides to them. They're not showing who they truly are. They're hiding something. They're pretending to be someone that they're not. They're pretending to feel something that they're not. They're hiding something. What is this person? What is this two of pentacles here? Someone playing two sides here. Six of wands because they want some sort of victory in the situation. Five of pentacles. Someone is playing this like a woe is me kind of a game. Okay, woe is me. Like I'm because they think that they're gonna get like sympathy points. Okay, this kind of giving me like somebody wants sympathy for something. What's the five of pentacles? Woe is me. Oh uh, yeah, hand of cards, sympathy. Yeah, take a chance, risk. This is definitely someone that's two faced and they're wearing a mask. And they're playing this like, oh, this is a strategy, being strategic. Oh man, I'm just gonna be so left out and I'm just so alone. And how can you leave me like this all by myself? And something like that. Friendship, meeting and conversing. Somebody wants to meet with someone and, and talk to someone, but they wanna wear a mask. They want to be two-faced here because they think that's how they're going to win by playing this card. Somebody's trying to play a card of like, oh, I'm just so neglected and I feel so alone. And Okay. Uh, who's the King of Pentacles? Nine of Cups. This is someone that's happy, content, feeling good. No, never mind. Five of Cups. This is someone that's sad, upset. Ten of Wands. So there's a King of Pentacles here who feels very burdened, feels a lot of pressure, feels very sad and upset right now. Why? Because of something with a home or something with their community or their neighborhood or maybe something about stability. Might have something to do with their stability. Why is somebody feeling so sad and upset here? Someone is, this King of Pentacles is sad. They're grieving. Maybe something that they felt like would make them happy. They feel very burdened right now. Could have something to do with the end of a relationship maybe even. They're playing both sides. Somebody's playing both sides though. They're, try they're wearing a mask. What's the Five of Cups? The truth. So somebody, somebody is very sad here about the truth, okay? This King of Pentacles is sad and upset about the truth, about some sort of clarity in the situation. Why do they feel so burdened, Ten of Wands? They feel burdened because of somebody is living in the moment someone is happily single and having fun so this could be about the end of a relationship okay this queen of pentacles is kind of giving me the one that might have ended the relationship with this king of pentacles because this king of pentacles was maybe even with the two of pentacles a mask like i don't know if someone was ha like having a double life maybe somebody was having a double life Maybe they weren't playing fair. They weren't um, showing their hand. They weren't showing everything. They weren't being honest about what they were up to, where they were going. Maybe somebody might be ha having a double life. And now the truth has come out about someone living in the moment and having fun. The truth about something in a home. And this Queen of Pentacles is now feeling upset or she she's rejecting someone now. She's rejecting someone because she feels like someone charmed her or used her. What's the Two of Pentacles? Uh, the Two of Cups, I mean.
unhealthy choices in yeah okay so this king of pentacles or someone here in this relationship they made bad choices okay they did not make the right choices in love or in life they didn't make healthy choices in this relationship um and now there's some sort of shocking new but but they didn't want something to change or they didn't want some sort of transformation what happened here between this queen of pentacles and king of pentacles what happened between them i feel like some some sort of truth came out eight of wands some sort of information or some sort of action happened and now someone is very stressed out and upset some something came in really quick okay some sort of information or some some sort of quick communication came in and now someone is very worried about this and upset about this okay i feel like someone here has been having a double life okay i don't know that's what i feel though temperance yeah like i don't know if this queen of pentacles just found out about something that this king of pentacles was doing behind their back okay because i feel like the king of pentacles is the one that's sad and burdened because they, were, they made really bad choices here. Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, they, they might have been acting like they were single or they were only focused on themselves here with the Nine of Cups, Nine of Pentacles. This could have been someone that was just doing whatever they wanted behind the scenes. Ten of Swords. Yeah, and they betrayed someone. This is a painful betrayal. So, some, so this King of Pentacles might have betrayed this Queen of Pentacles badly, okay? King of Swords and the King of Wands. Huh. Okay. So, I don't know who all these men are. Okay. You're going to know, Pisces, who all these men are. Okay. What's the Five of Swords reverse? The Three of Pentacles. So somebody here might not be able to defend themselves. The Hermit. Because of people that have been working together to find a solution, have been looking into something. Into a betrayal, Ten of Swords. Or some sort of betrayal might have been uncovered here with the Five of Swords in reverse. Somebody uncovered a betrayal. What's the betrayal? Ten of Swords. Cassette. Something on a cassette. Or replaying events over in your head. It's like... Hmm. I feel like something was uncovered here. What's the Hermit? The lovers. Okay. So I feel like somebody might have had a secret lover. If I'm being honest, somebody might have had an affair here. Okay. Somebody might have been having a double life. Somebody didn't make good choices in a relationship. And I feel like it came out. Like somebody found out about it. Okay. Okay. I don't know if it's this queen of pentacles here maybe that looked into something like she wanted to find something out and she found the answers about a lover maybe like somebody i feel like betrayed someone here Who, what's, what's the three of uh, pentacles a mature man a mature man that was working together with others found something out about a lover, someone having a lover, and now a marriage is in bad health. Yeah, I feel like this is a married couple where it was uncovered that one of them was having like a double life, like the king of pentacles, okay? With the two of pentacles here and mask. Something was uncovered here about this person. What's the five of swords reverse? A date, yeah, I'm, yeah. Somebody was planning a date. Somebody was meeting up with someone and it was found out. Something was exposed that there was a king of pentacles here who was meeting other people. Okay. And I feel like someone's wife might have found out about it. Okay. This queen of pentacles, whoever this is. Hmm. Now what's the three of swords? 
someone is heartbroken now because of some sort of shocking news. Somebody is very shocked about this epiphany, about this upheaval. Something is shocking and it's heartbreaking. Very heartbreaking here. Whatever was found out. Who is this King of Wands? The Five of Swords. There was a King of Wands here who was trying to win at all costs here. Planning something in the future. Who is this King of Wands? This is someone who found, who knows the truth. What do you mean with the Five of Swords and this King of Wands? The Magician. Why do I feel like this King of Wands exposed someone? Am I getting this correctly? And, but it's kind of giving me like a revenge thing. Queen of Swords. Like the star. Why is this King of Wands here in this Five of Swords energy? Family, Ten of Cups. Does that have something to do with a family or someone having a family maybe? Maybe this King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles have a family here. Nine of Swords and someone was very worried about their family. Is this King of Wands, what kind of a person is this? Is this a kind of a mean person or is, is this, a, who is this? Six of Wands. Why do I feel like the, the a page of wands and the th three of swords? I I don't know why I feel like this was like an ultimatum gone wrong. Okay. Like somebody, cause that's what I was getting at the very beginning where someone was like, Hey, I know the truth about you. I know the truth about you, and if you don't do what I say, then I'm going to do this, this, and this. And the person was like, fine, do it. And they did it. They actually did it. And I, it might have something to do with exposing someone. Like, I feel like somebody just got exposed for a double life they were having, maybe even an affair, some sort of betrayal. And I almost want to say that this King of Wands is the one that was doing, like, the blackmailing or the the ultimatum like the blackmailing and then when it didn't go their way their way they actually like expose someone like that's kind of what i feel <sighs> something about a betrayal in a home or a betrayal in a community or somebody betrayed their community somebody betrayed like maybe they even let tried to leave a community like maybe somebody tried to leave a community they tried to leave a system maybe they tried to leave something behind and for that it's kind of giving me like um like you know that there's there's some kind of there's some kinds of societies and groups that you once you get into them you cannot leave them they won't let you leave and if you leave they'll ruin your life like that's kind of what I'm feeling in this is that somebody tried to leave a community behind and then and they thought maybe they maybe they thought that person wasn't serious but they were and they might have leaked something I don't know or something like that am I getting this correctly this energy king of cups in reverse hierophant in reverse someone here is heartless like they do not care they do not care they, do, they have no moral compass whatsoever. Someone here does not care about someone's feelings. Someone here is heartless. Someone here is morally corrupt. Or maybe somebody tried to leave an institution. Maybe somebody tried to leave a group. Hierophant in reverse. They tried to leave a group. Tell me more about this King of Wands, knowing the truth. He held on to something. This King of Wands had held on to something with a community or he wanted somebody to stay in a community or he was trying to hold this community together or something that was built together. I feel like this King of Wands was trying to exert some sort of control over someone. I feel
feel like they were trying to exert control over someone. They were trying to force someone to stay by like blackmailing them or telling them, if you don't do this, I'm gonna do this and this and this, and somebody left. Anyways, that's what I feel. I'm just waiting on the confirmation that, that that's correct. Page of Cups. Five of Wands. There was a fight that broke out. Some sort of an altercation broke out. Because of somebody giving something to someone? Somebody gave something to someone? What do you mean? Nine of Wands and somebody was defensive. Or it might even be this conflict that broke out and somebody wanted maybe Six of Pentacles, wanted someone to do something for them or wanted someone to give something to them and, and the other person was defensive or something like that. King of Wands in reverse, yeah. So this King of Wands is not a good person. No, this is someone that is very cold, calculated, heartless, has a hot temper. This is someone that, I mean, this masculine has come out in the reverse. King of Wands reverse, King of Swords reverse, King of Cups reverse. This is someone that said, okay, you wanna go that way? Fine, I'm gonna expose you, okay? Like this is some sort of, it honestly feels like some sort of negotiation gone wrong, okay? Very wrong, because I feel like somebody was exposed here and it like is ruining, it's gonna ruin their marriage. It's gonna ruin their family or something like that. What's that Ace of Coins? The King of Swords. It has something to do with a gift with a King of Swords or some sort of money that was given to a King of Swords, Seven of Pentacles. It has something to do with money. It has something to do with a money gift or a money investment, something with a king of swords and losing money, a ton of pentacles reverse. So there might have been a lot of money that was on the line here. Five of wands, yeah, there was. There was a lot of money that was on the line and it has something to do with maybe this king of wands and this king of swords losing a lot of money. Like, it feels like the stakes were really high on something. So they might have tried to exert pressure over someone because they didn't want to lose all this money. Like there was a lot of money on the line. Like you need to do as we say, because there's a lot of money here. And somebody like, somebody, I feel like, somebody didn't, somebody was, might have, did this person, this King of Pentacles go against the King of Wands? Yeah, he did. So, yeah, he did. Seven of Wands and the Queen of Wands. Somebody went against this person. So somebody stood their ground. I feel like this King of Pentacles said, they stood their ground against something, maybe. It has something to do with taking action or taking the next step with some sort of financial news or some sort of money or some sort of an investment, something to do with buying something, maybe, investing into something, taking the next step. And they fought about it and there was a fight the devil and there was a fight so okay let me just get this straight so i'm not confusing something the king of wands wanted to put pressure on the king of pentacles to do something here for this group the king of pentacles said i don't want to do this anymore and then the king of wands decided to ruin their life or what gave something to the emperor. So they gave something to this emperor. The king of wands went to the emperor with an offer or they wanted an, or somebody wanted an offer from the emperor. Okay, and then what happened then? And then somebody decided not to take this risk. Somebody did not want to take this risk. Or somebody did something foolish. Somebody did something foolish because they wanted to keep something hidden or what's the limit? The King of Cups. What? Who's this now? The King of Wands. Or somebody didn't want to do something because of maybe a king of cups and the king of wands looking into something. Who's this hermit? A message in reverse. A 
a main male. They didn't, somebody didn't want to give the message. Somebody didn't want to hand in the message. Somebody didn't get the message. Somebody didn't want to take the message or it was bad news or with a gift. So somebody tried to give someone a gift or somebody tried to bring something to an emperor having to do with a gift, but this was a risk. This was risky. And now why is the message in reverse? Seven of pent, uh, seven of cups. It was some sort of, somebody was confused about what to do about if they should take a risk or not. So somebody was confused if they should do this or not, if they should take this risk. The world because a cycle was closing out what's the what's message in reverse the runner somebody didn't want to do this somebody didn't want to do something here somebody wanted to run away somebody didn't want to take the message somebody what didn't want to do something somebody didn't want to take this risk that's kind of what i feel somebody felt like something was too risky they didn't want to do something but a, a lot of money was on the line. So what's the Six of Swords then? Somebody decided to leave something behind here. What did they leave behind? Their occupation. Working together with someone maybe, despair in reverse. They didn't want to be trapped in something. Somebody might have walked away from working together with someone, okay? That's kind of what I feel too, Six of Swords. And something to do with a message that was given to a King of Pentacles or a message about a King of Pentacles, a message to the King of Pentacles, or this King of Pentacles sent a message to someone saying that they're not gonna work together anymore or they don't wanna work anymore. Seven of Swords because of some sort of deception or some sort of lying and the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. And then they, created an illusion that maybe this king of pentacles, pentacles was then going to lose the queen of pentacles or hmm if this reading is for you you'll know okay i'm not quite sure what this is yet what's the seven of swords the mirror mirroring each other introspection somebody might have done some sort of introspection and that and they realize that something is too like deceptive something is too like um something feels too criminal okay what's the six of swords i wanted to leave something behind here the golden mirror so there's somebody who, who might be either they're trying to get away from some sort of golden of self-absorbed narcissist love bombing or they are someone that's like trying to think about themselves now. Like they're just trying to be selfish. They're like, I don't want to do this anymore because I need to think about me now. I need to think about what's best for me. But the people coming towards this person were like, um, no, you're going to do what's best for the group. Who do you think you are? Like something like that is going on here is what I feel. Um, what's this communication that came in? Eight of Wands, Nine of Swords. Strength. Somebody try to come in with information or communication, trying to overpower someone. Three of wands in reverse, trying to stop them from, um, this is giving me again this ultimatum. It's like, if you don't do it as I say with strength, if you don't do what I tell you to do, I'm gonna block your future. I'm gonna fuck up your life for you. Your life is gonna be over if you don't do what I say. Someone's trying to have control over someone, maybe even through aggression and like hostility. Like, do as I say, or I'm going to fuck up. Yeah, trying to regain control. Somebody is trying to hold on to someone or hold on to someone, hold on to, like, control over someone, okay? They don't want someone to leave. But somebody is defensive. Seven of wands, nine of wands. Or they're trying to block someone. They're trying to stop someone. Who's the six of swords trying to get away? Who is this in the six of swords trying to get away? The person that's living a double life, two of pentacles. Someone's trying to leave behind a double life. Or someone's trying to leave behind taking some sort of action for someone, like, or get away from this fire sign. Queen of Wands. Somebody's trying to 
move on to calmer waters here. Leave something behind with a queen of wands. And something to do with the ace of coins, something with money. Or this gift, or this investment, or this money gift, or money offer. Someone's leaving this behind. Why? Four of Cups, because they feel like something... Because of the Queen of Pentacles and the Four of Cups, which is the same thing up here, which is that someone feels like something is over now or they're going to get rejected or someone is rejecting them or someone is standoffish to them. Somebody doesn't want them. Someone is rejecting them. High Priestess. Somebody could be getting like threatened with a mistress. Like, I know your dirty little secret. If you don't do as I say, then I'm gonna, um, Knight of Cups, you need, to, you need to do what we want you to do. You need to take this. Nine of Cups, Two of Cups, but somebody is thinking about themselves and their relationship. Or somebody might be targeting their relationship or whoever the oppressor is, is targeting this person's relationship because they know that this is what makes them happy. Like it's their family or something like that. That's why, or why is this person, who's in the six of swords here? Who's trying to get out of this? Yeah, somebody's trying to walk away. Somebody's trying to leave something behind. What are they trying to leave behind? What are they trying to walk away from? The, somebody trying to hurt them, three of swords, trying to hurt them or trying to hurt the queen of pentacles. Trying to hurt them or hurt the Queen of Pentacles. I feel like it has something to do with hurting them or their wife. Or hurting their wife. Like, I feel like someone is threatening them with something to expose them. Or it has something to do with hurting their wife or their family. Like, someone's trying to leave this behind. The tower. Yeah, because someone was having... Somebody had a double life. Two of Pentacles. And somebody that knows that they, this person had a double life is threatening to expose them. And now they're trying to walk away because they don't want... I don't know if this person already found out. Like, I don't know if the Queen of Pentacles already found out about the double life. And now they just want to leave it behind. And they don't want this person to be hurt anymore. And they just... Something like that. What's this... Um, what's the four points reverse? The Six of Cups. Somebody is now letting go of some sort of control. Or they're, they're releasing something because of the past. Knight of Swords. The High Priest is in reverse. It has something to do with a mistress. That's what I feel. Yeah, Ten of Swords. It has to do with betrayal. Yeah. Somebody betrayed someone here. Somebody betrayed someone. Somebody had a mistress. And now they feel trapped. They feel like someone is trying to trap them with this. Okay, so, okay, spirit, so, okay, so now I kind of got the story here, but what's important about this? I mean, why are you showing me this? Because it has something to do with pain. Somebody's going through pain. Somebody's in pain about a relationship, about a lover. Or somebody's trying to hurt someone with a lover. Hmm. The nine of pentacles and their career it's an emperor i feel like this is an emperor that's hurting right now temperance yeah they feel like they can't heal this they feel like they feel like they can't heal from this they feel really imbalanced this king of pentacles feels really imbalanced i feel like this person is hurting a lot they're hurting right now because they don't want um something to be exposed well, maybe it already has been their past. Ace of Wands reverse. They don't know what to do. They feel like they're losing hope. They feel like they can't do something here. Nine of Wands. They feel, they're, they're fighting back or they feel like they need to fight back or take a stand. Take a stand against what? Queen of Pentacles. They feel like they need to protect their family. They need to protect their wife. This King of Pentacles is trying to protect their wife. 
their family. This is their wife, I'm pretty sure. This is someone in their, they're in a relationship with. They're trying to protect this their wife from being hurt. They don't want their wife to be hurt. They don't want their wife to find out about something. They don't want this, they don't want to hurt this person. There's, this person had a double life. Now they're being blackmailed with it, I'm pretty sure. And they are trying to figure out how they're going to get out of this without their wife finding out about what happened. And it has something to do with some sort of an investment or something that was bought or Ten of Swords. Why do I feel like the Page of Pentacles is like whatever, there's something tangible, like there, there's something tangible, like something like a hard copy of something. There's, some, there's a hard copy of something and it has to do with betrayal. Or, okay, what is this hard copy, this Page of Pentacles? Like up there we have a cassette, so it might actually be something like on some sort of a hard copy here, okay? Heartbroken and they're heartbroken about this. They are heartbroken. They are really going through it. Photographs. There's proof. There's a, there's absolutely some sort of hard evidence, hard proof. Hard evidence, hard proof. Photographs, cassettes, something tangible, something that someone can hold in their hand that shows that this person betrayed someone and had a double life, maybe even had an affair. And this King of Pentacles is now doing everything to make sure that they don't want to lose their wife. They don't want to lose their wife. They are absolute. And remember at the very beginning with Tower and the Ten of Cups, someone is going through a tower with their family. I said, keep it in mind, remember? Because those two just flipped out on their own. Someone is going through a tower right now because of their family. Someone does not want to lose their family or their wife. Someone is extremely stressed out and worried about their family finding out about something, okay? They don't want something to get out. But they're being, I'm pretty sure they're being blackmailed. King of Swords. I'm almost... These two are blackmailing this person. King of Wands and a King of Swords. These two are blackmailing someone. Like, I don't know who this King of Wands is, King of Swords is. I don't know if this is like, if this, who are these people? No idea. Okay, I don't know if these are like members of some sort of a society, members of a group. This could be members of a society, of a brotherhood, of something. I don't know. I don't know if they're brothers. I don't know if it's a family. I don't know if it's, I, I'm not really getting that it's a family. I feel like it's something bigger than that, like some sort of a group, okay? And they have some sort of leverage on this person. It's these two masculines, or this is the same person. I don't know, maybe this is a this is an air sign masculine that has fire in their chart or vice versa. I don't know if it's the same person or who. Six of wands, yeah, this is, could be the same person, I don't know. And this King of Pentacles is trying to stop this from blowing up in their face. They are doing everything to make sure that something does not blow up in their face. And their driving force right now is that they do not want their wife to find out about something. Okay, that's the driving force behind it all. All right, let's see if we can find out who these masculines are, huh, Pisces? Now, Pisces, I don't know what the fuck you have to do with any of this, okay, but... It's important, apparently, for you to know. So, a secret society, I'm... Yo, I felt it. That's crazy that that's the first one that came, comes out. So, these people, this King of Pentacles, King of Wands, and C uh, King of Swords, they could be a part of a secret society. A society, a brotherhood, something like that. They're part of a group. The police, okay? So, this has something to do with the police. Oh, well, we all know, I mean... A Libra could be involved here. Someone's boss, okay? Grandparent or parents could be involved. A gang member, but I honestly feel like it's a member of a secret society. This King of Pentacles is a member of a society here. IRS, I don't know. Police, IRS, these people could, you know, it's not a secret that there's people in high places that are part of groups, okay? That's, that's how the world exists today. That's how the world runs, I guess. Capricorn. This Queen of Pentacles could be a Capricorn. Because I remember a lot of readings where things like Cap Capricorn girlfriend, Capricorn wife would come out. So this could be a Capricorn wife or something like that. Leo could be involved. We have a father. This person could be a father too. Okay, a religious leader. 
A husband, yeah. This, a husband and a wife. That is the issue right now. July, definitely. A Gemini. Maybe this King of Swords is a Gemini. Okay, we got a Taurus. Maybe King of Pentacles is a Taurus. Capricorn wife. Aries could be involved, okay? And a religious leader. These are these are leaders of their community. And I don't I don't feel like it's just family. Like I said, I feel like this is something that goes above that. So I'm gonna leave it at that, guys. Thanks for watching. Until next time, bye.